All right, in this video, I'm going to show you how to find your inputs on your Roku TV. Boom. Your inputs, first of all, are these right here. And these are the default inputs, AV, Blu-ray pair, satellite TV, live TV, stream box. But if you want, you can change those names or you can delete or add inputs. What you have to do is use your Roku on your home screen and you're gonna go down to settings, all right? Then you're gonna come over here and you're just gonna roll down to TV inputs. Now you can go over and you can, if you wanted to, you could rename this. <laughs> and they give you a whole bunch of different things, look. DVD player, DVR, VCR, AV receiver, sound bar, game console, you know, camera, camcorder. Look at all these different things. Smartphone, custom settings, an icon. You know, if you wanted to set a custom setting, you could do it there. But we'll just go back and we'll just leave it on that. Now, if you wanted to remove this, you just go over here and you click on that and that input is removed, but we're not gonna do that. All right, then we're gonna go back here and let's go down to satellite and you can do the same thing with all these. You know what I mean? So that gives you the opportunity to do that. Inputs, basically what that means is that this is things that you plug into the, uh, um, the TV that are exterior to the TV. Uh, let's go back to the uh, home page. All of these applications like Netflix, they're set in the TV. They're not an input. I don't have to put an HDMI plug into the TV to watch that stuff. But if I had a Blu-ray player, that means it's an exterior product that's, that's down here underneath and I've got to run a plug up in there and plug it in. And then I can switch to that and we can watch whatever feed comes out of that. Just like the satellite TV down here, I have satellite TV hooked up to this. And if I wanted to watch satellite TV, I would have to go to satellite TV. I would have to navigate to it and then press the button. And, uh, and then I got to click on a different remote to watch it. But let's go back to our homepage. So those are your inputs and that's what you can do with them. Um, again, to navigate, you use the, you use the arrows. To choose, you use the center button. And that's pretty much how that works. All right, if you like this video, subscribe to my channel. Check out my other awesome videos. Peace out.